Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be doing a recent pickups video just to show you some of the stuff I got recently and a few of my Christmas presents. Um, I know I'm a bit late to the party with the whole Christmas thing, but never mind. We've been pretty busy with like exams and stuff, so I haven't really been able to do videos, but um, I'll show you some of the, ga well, the games I got for Christmas and a couple of things I got before. I'm not sure if I've already showed them in a pickup video before, but hey. I also got some CDs, about 40 of them. I won't show them because it will go on too long. And a record player, which is pretty cool. So, here's a couple games that I got recently, but not for Christmas. Alone in the Dark, The New Nightmares for the PlayStation. And Speedball 2 for the Mass system like a robot football game it's pretty cool now on to the stuff I got for Christmas for the 3DS Super Mario 3D 3D Land um, and it says on a classic Mario action with a modern twist and that sums it up pretty well it's got some elements that are from the older games and also some um, newer elements and it works really well in 3D and some people say it's the best Mario game um, and I wouldn't argue with that it's a great game though I haven't um, beaten it yet um, I've got to world 8 but apparently there's 8 more worlds after that and yeah the 3D works really well although I don't use turn it up all the way Um, onto the Xbox 360 Test Drive Unlimited 2 Now I was a big fan of the original and I'm pleased to say they've improved a lot with this game, it's even better than the old one I think the graphics are better and the um, road design, better cars I suppose um, a more focused career mode in that like, it tells you what to do rather than you just wander around finding things to do and another racing game for the Xbox 360 Forza Motorsport 4 and again this is a great improvement on Forza 3 um, it's more of the same but better I'd say it's got the Top Gear um, track which is pretty cool and you can do some like temping bowling games or well, more than temping actually but on the um, Top Gear track kind of reminds me of like in Crazy Taxi where you have to try and knock down as many pins as you can. So yeah, that's a pretty cool feature. And of course it's got online play on Xbox Live. I think up to 16 cars, which is an improvement on 4 to 3. And it also, it's also compatible with the Kinect um, sensor, but I haven't got one of them, so I haven't tested it out. And I believe um, you only uh, control the steering rather than the accelerated and the braking which I imagine would be a bit annoying because sometimes the auto brake brakes too early and stuff so uh, I prefer just using the controller now on to a couple of Wii games I got Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword um, and this version comes with the CD as well which is pretty cool because you know Nintendo games are known for good soundtracks and this game's got a good soundtrack and also gameplay wise people are saying it's the best Zelda and once again I wouldn't argue with that it's been really fun from what I've played so far though I haven't got that far on it yet so yeah I'd recommend that game and last but not least Kirby's Epic Yarn. One of the good things about this game is that you can't die, which is quite a, a plus point for me because, you know, I'm not exactly brilliant at games, but yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Me and my brother have been playing it quite a bit together. Um, it's just really cool how they incorporated the idea of yarn into a game, like you um, pull on to things and 
peel things back. It's just really, really polished and looks great. Lots of nice level designs. Yes, yeah, fun to play game. So yeah, those are uh, those are the stuff I got for Christmas. Um, and I hope all of you had a good Christmas and a happy New Year. And I'll try and get back to doing some more reviews soon. Um, yeah, um, so I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll put up another video soon. Bye.